today we will go through uh, this agenda so first uh, i would like to uh, discuss more about what is curadar siem then we will talk about what are we doing with curadar community edition and what's new in this curadar community edition from the last version which we released that year and then we will go through the demo where we will explain about installing curadar community edition on your workstation or on your laptop and how we can configure the it so first what is curadar siem uh, most of the people who are already part of corporate uh, are aware of this or who are already in uh, security domain are aware of this but since uh, this presentation is also targeted to student or uh, new new uh, new people new engineers in uh, who are joining in the uh, security domain so curadar is a comprehensive security solution that provides real time visibility into organizations it infrastructure so you can see this diagram so which will basically provide uh, us the architecture of curadar and where we collects data or collect logs or events from all the devices which are part of our network and we send it to one device data collector or uh, that is basically part of curadar and then we process on it we save the data and we use it for reporting or or raising incidents so what are the key features of curadar first is log management so it basically collects and normalizes the data which we receive from various sources across the network so each data source uses different protocol or different style of data we collect it through different ways and then normalize it then we have incident detection and response what are the collected data we correlate those events and identify the incident or prioritize and also prioritize that security incident real time monitoring so we can continuously monitor all these events and the threats and vulnerabilities which are generated through curator we use advanced analytics like user uh, machine learning and behavioral analytics to detect the anomalies as well curator does good job of doing compliance reporting where we generates reports which help meet the regulatory compliance requirement or the reports which we can provide to higher management to get the overview of all the events or all the incidents we receive uh, from the all the devices in the network so what is the benefit so we get the improved visibility since we are receiving all events from all the network devices or all the devices in the in our organization we have improved visibility across entire network we use uh multiple rule responses and hence we get better threat detection and response then we have streamlined compliance and reporting so all the reports all the required reports or all the required compli compliance we can uh, save it and then we can generate reports based on that and hence we get the reduced we have reduced time in detecting and responding to an incident now let's explore what is curadar community edition so by releasing this curadar community edition along with our curadar enterprise which is sold to customers we need to make this curadar available for all the community users for their hands on without purchasing any support or without giving any money this community edition will offer student developer and security teams or small organizations to use all the curadar feature without spending a any any cost so that they can be aware of all the curadar future features before they actually buy the product or they can experiment on the curadar siem so this curadar version which we have released recently is of 7.5 up8 package which is installed on rhl8.8 .8. and we provide you a fixed 3 months renewal license of 100 eps and 5000 fpm free of cost so you can download this 
from this link. So I will just click on it. You will get uh, on this link where you can download the QRadar community edition. Now you can click on download, which will take you to download link. Uh, you can go through all the all this web page to understand what are the features and what all we can do with QRadar community editions. Once you click on download, it will take you to this page where you can download the ISO. Along with that, you can download the temporary key, which is of three months validity and you'll get that this, this license key will expire on 1st August. On, on 30th September, we will provide you the next refreshed renewal key. Okay, let's go back to our slide now. So let's understand what are we giving you different from Enterprise QRadar and what is the different, what are we providing different from the older version of community edition. So earlier we, we had a separate uh, development stream where we special, we use specialized JVM that could run on low spec, uh, spec of hardware and it needed separate work stream. And that was the reason we couldn't release uh, any community version after 7.3.3 because it needed extra development efforts. Now this with this version we have we are or we are providing you the exact image of our enterprise build but you will have some license restrictions. So we are providing you the ISO file where earlier we, we provided OVA file which you could import on your workstation. But now with ISO file, you can install the QRadar Community Edition 7.5. Now in this version, we are giving you 100 EPS, where in, early, in earlier version, we used to give you 50 EPS, which is double the EPS and that too in free of cost. FPM, we are giving you same as before 5000 FPM. Now, the, since it is exact replica of our QRadar Enterprise our, uh, version, the memory requirement has increased to 24 GB, 24 GB and CPU required are 4 at minimal 4 and recommended is 6. Now, the storage requirement is same, which is 250 GB. Now, with this community edition, earlier in 733, we can only install console, but now uh, we can install console as well as app host so that you can uh, get get your hands dirty on the applications as well, which you can install on the 7.5 community editions. So license earlier community edition version, we, we, were, we weren't providing any license, uh, but through this community edition, we are providing three months license that too renewable. But wherein for enterprise server, we provide perpetual license that comes with the support subscription as well. Now you get the trial license, which we ship with our QRadar enterprise as well. That basically gives you 5000 EPS and 20 million FPM for 35 days. So this is basically a very well, a very good benefit of installing QRadar community edition as well. Now, if you check function wise comparison, since earlier community ver version was uh, had a different work stream, we could only replicate few functionalities of it. But now this community edition has almost all the functionalities which are same as our production QRadar or enterprise QRadar. Now you will get daily and weekly auto updates as well uh, through this community edition wherein we did not get these updates on earlier QRadar community edition version, which 7.3.3. .3. Support subscription. So you do not need any support subscription for community edition and the support available is only through community support, which you can, uh, like if you face any issue, you can post your uh, queries on the community and all the community member will assist you along with uh, uh, all the community, uh, all the security experts. Then upgrade, we, whether we can upgrade the community edition. So answer is no, we cannot, we won't be able to upgrade as you will need a SFS file to upgrade, but we are providing the ISO that is only, that will keep you on the same version. 
in future whenever we release multiple uh, wherever we release uh, further versions of curator we will have same community we will have the community edition released for those, those versions as well you need to install those now whether we can install this community edition on the cloud so answer is no this image is not available on cloud platform wherein we can we we can use the enterprise curator on uh, cloud market as well so these are the differences you can see we have uh, we have improved ourselves uh, up to our curator enterprise for getting uh, getting all the uh, all the uh, security enthusiasts to get their hands dirty on the newer version of curator community edition